up guys, welcome back. So today we're working on a universal gun holster. So I had a customer come in and his father had one uh, that was got, had some tooling on it, but he wanted one that was just straight black. So I actually did uh, a double sided, so it's got black in the, you know, uh, on the front, black in the back. And this leather I purchased from Springfield Leather Company. It, it is a Herman Oak bridle, eight to 10 ounce. And um, so the video actually cuts off kind of about right where I cut out my uh, stencil. I forgot to make sure my video was recording when I cut out the black leather and then glued it together. But everything else is, will be in there. I'll show you guys how to do the sewing and all that. And um, yeah, and as far as the holes, use this guy, two holes, Hole there, hole there, and just cut out the middle. Easy enough. So, all right, let's get started. What's up, Smokey? How you doing, buddy? Say hi. Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back. So, I had a customer get a hold of me. They wanted me to make him a, uh, basically, just a duplicate of this guy. So this is a universal gun holster. I guess it'll kind of fit whatever size gun you're working with, whatever you work, you know, whatever you want to carry that day, I guess. But uh, he wants one to make, wants one made just like it, but just out of black. So that's why I ordered some stuff from Springfield. They actually sell, you know, like one foot square pieces of leather. So I actually got a couple of those. All right, now. Get to the real stuff. Here it is. Bada bang. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. Perfect. So okay. Next up, I'm just going to take and just sand these edges, get these edges all real nice. All right, so I've got my uh, stitching line here, so I'm gonna go ahead and get this guy stitched up. Just bring it just a little bit closer here. Bring it down on in where the action is. Yeah, how you liking that, huh? There you go, all up in it now.
All right, so there we go. All finished. Now I did make these holes a little bit bigger because this stuff is um, quite a bit thicker. So I wanted it to be able to move a little bit more on the belt. So we'll see how that works out with the, with the guy and then uh, go from there. But overall, it came out great. Looks good.